Well, in this video, I'm going to talk about linear model. Many signal processing problems can be formulated as linear model, and we can find minimum variance on bias estimator and efficient estimator for linear model. Consider the data vector as an n by 1 vector and h is called observation matrix and n by p and theta is the vector of parameters uh, with dimension of p w is noise vector which is distributed as normal with zero mean and the diagonal covariance matrix sigma 2 i i stands for identity matrix and here we consider the observation noise as a white process we will see later in general model the observation noise uh, may be correlated and there in that case the observation covariance uh, the noise covariance matrix is not diagonal okay let's continue and find efficient estimator for the theta first of all we form the probability density function of observation because uh, the noise uh, vector is Gaussian is we can easily form the probability density function and then uh, taking logarithm we will have this one now we can simplify this expression here and by multiplying this one we will have this x transpose x minus theta transpose h, h transpose x minus x transpose h theta plus theta transpose h transpose h theta in the middle of this expression there are two terms which are scalars and both of them are identical if we uh, take transpose we can see both of them uh, are the same so after this we can find the gradient of log likelihood with respect to the vector of parameters the derivative of this term is zero and here this term is zero this term is this term here minus two x transpose h theta can be uh, h transpose minus two h transpose x and this term theta transpose h transpose h theta is the derivative is its derivative is to uh, h transpose h theta if you see this term uh, you can uh, find the out it can be easily uh, write like this uh, and I will continue to uh, rewrite this term uh, as like this formula to drive the efficient estimation. Okay, minus. The term must be uh, alone for uh, finding the efficient estimator. So uh, I use this term. Uh, then I have to use inverse of this matrix here. As you can see, this is equivalent to i of theta g of x minus theta and finally we have efficient estimator for linear model as inverse of h transpose h 
assurance falls x and the covariance matrix is the inverse of visual information matrix is equal to sigma 2 assurance falls h inverse it is important to see uh, this matrix uh, should have, I mean, a strand of S should be invertible. So the rank of this matrix, this is a P, uh, P by P matrix. And the rank of this matrix must be P. I mean, it should be full rank. For this, the rank of observation matrix must be P. This means the column of the observation matrix must be linearly dependent. Thank you for watching this video.